Welcome back to Critics News with more update on as you take the go. <laughs> uh, wonder shall never end. Information reaching us now says that um, <laughs> an election official has made a way, has run away and disappeared with over 40 results from the Anambra election going on now. And uh, here is uh, the rigging process <laughs> that they are trying to connect so that they can win. Um, even though, ah, which people do you think should win this election, say, by the way, in Anambra State? Let me know through the comment section. But here, um, before I talk about this uh, full story of this running away of these voters' um, <laughs> materials and the voters' result, um, here is that our brother that is doing comedy uh, called DK. <laughs> to show you, let me tell you something. All of you that are celebrities are being belletricy. You see? He said, I'm afraid of being a citizen of this country. Comedian DK says, as he narrates how police officers allegedly threatened and extorted him of uh, over 50,000 naira in that like you, like you. That is a legit somebody, at least this boy now, we know him, that he's doing skit, he's doing comedy and all that. But that one no concern the Nigerian police. If they want to obtain you, guy, <laughs> they must rob you, no matter whether you be celebrity or be belletricy. You know, concern them. So that is the one Nigeria that you are supporting. So if you are going to Christmas this year, I want to tell you to be very, very careful. As Onyibo, it doesn't matter whether you be celebrity, or, uh -huh, they will still tell you that it is an accidental discharge. Now look at it here. They say um, election, Anambra decides 2021, election officials disappears with result sheet on Anambra, <laughs> Anambra word. Okay, let me, of Anambra word, let me, let me look at it. Now they say that um, an election official has disappeared with almost the entire result sheet of the governorship election held at a word in Idemili South local government area, the news agency of Nigeria, NAN, is reporting thus disenfranchising 40,000 voters who were eligible to vote. But now, because of this very incident, <laughs> he made away with everything, and that's the end of the vote in that uh, region. Nobody can vote again from that place. Okay? So this is Nigeria for you. According to Nan, Gabriel Otong, the returning officer of the local government, announced during the collation of results in Oka, the state capital, that the official supervising polling officer, SPO, disappeared with 41 of the 42 result sheets for 89 polling units in Anambra State, um, polling unit in the area. So this is the reason why IPOB... Um, cancelled the election or say that um, they are going to sit at home on that very day but you can see it now so at the end of the day <laughs> who is the cause is it not the government even as i'm telling you this thing now the name of the officer is not here mr otong a lecturer from the university of calabar in cross river also added that there was no election in oba one ward one oba ward two and akuku ward Akuku Ward, all in Idemili South local government area of Anambra State, which means nobody, there was no election in those words because the man who was supposed to bring um, the materials um, made away with them, and uh, so nobody could vote anything. Nobody, there was no voting in that uh, particular location because of what <laughs> the owner, the owner has taken the election materials. One of the SPOs scattered. 41 resource sheet out of the 42 resource sheet meant uh, for the 89 polling unit in the affected words. Over 40,000 voters were not able to vote in the affected areas due to the development, he said. The returning officer said some of the polling units did not get the development of electoral officials due to cases of gunshot. So they, <laughs> they said our non government operated in that zone. However, Obere Ubiya, called the agent of all progressive Congress APC, said there was election in those places, but the result was not collated. This was uh, countered by Alex Obiobulu, the coalition agent of People's Democratic Party, PDP, who said no election was held in any of the affected places. 
Victor Ume of All Progressive Grand Alliance, Abga, corroborated Mr. Obiolu's account, insisting there was no election in those areas. So this is um, how the election is going and how the result matter is going. Meanwhile, the result of the top three parties is released for Idemili South, where APC 1036, APGA 2312, PDP 2016. Then Idemili South local government area has a total of 112,652, out of which only 6,622 voters were accredited. You know, even the distinct couldn't identify their INEC so-called machine couldn't identify the faces of uh, people who wanted to vote that is how backward we are everything you want to import into this country let me quickly play you this video of um, how they tried to rig this election okay we are watching now see and this woman may come out for here okay oh yeah This, yeah. That is rigging in progress. This, yeah. That's I neck official. Bam. You see how the, the election went? You see how they rigged everything? They can even rig your head. <laughs> they can rig anything that concerns you, including your family. They will, they will rig it over and over again, in case you don't know. Even the police people were being owed. You see them protesting here, IGP. <laughs> You see, even the police policemen did not get their allowances, but you people were hired to kill people there. You were shooting and celebrating. Now, to pay you is a problem. This is how Nigeria um, treats uh, their own. This is how you people are going to continue to suffer in that country because the people who are fighting for your liberation, you guys are busy killing them. And, uh, you know, you receiving orders from our guy at the top. Kill them. He them. Even APC was trying to bribe our mama them. See? Okay, this is when the PVC. This is how the machine couldn't capture the faces of people who came to vote. So, and nothing is working in Nigeria. Nothing. You couldn't capture. Now, watch the video. Let's see him. Even that man face safe. Can spoil my shin. You see how the thing is going. Even that man self, I'm suspecting he maybe a quality bribe somehow. <laughs> and the information detected. Although INEC is a failure in Nigeria, INEC is a total failure. If your machine could not detect uh, faces of uh, voters, then that's a very big shame to INEC on its own. I have a couple of videos. And then also, um, the Aosa community in uh, Anambra State have made their demand to the incoming governor. They, they made it clear. They told him what they want him to do <laughs> for them. I said, okay. <laughs> 
it is only this administration we as we experience mm. that a northerner will be appointed to be part of the government. Mm -hmm. We really have appointed two of our people to be a special advisor on Islamic affairs. Mm. We really have constituted Muslim program uh, 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 boards. We really have also constituted cartel menace control committees. What we are appealing, what we are praying for God, that anybody that will succeed fully will do the same thing that he's doing. With the present problem that we are facing in this nation, all the southern states are going for prohibiting uh, open grazing. Mm -hmm. So this open grazing is affecting, will affect us, and at long last it will not affect only us, it will affect even uh, the indigenous. Because uh, Igbos are known to do all the offensive with cow. Before this administration, there are clashes between herdsmen and farmers. But with this administration, we have this committee. And whenever a farm was destroyed, the committee will be alerted. Mm. The chairman of the committee is the that is the commissioner of police in the state. Mm. We have to go and fish out the full animals that have destroyed the farm, and they must pay. Whenever a cow was killed, we will inform the police. Police will call the leader of the community. Mm. We will fish out the people that killed the cow. They must pay for the cow they killed. So since this administration, we feel uh, uh, carried along. So we are doing as we are also part of this state. I part of the state. In the security it was one of the best problems in Walowo, Uzo. You see, you see, Uzo, you, you see the road, Abga, Willie Obiano, you just went into government house and you were drinking, drinking all sorts of hot, lying down different, in different places. See the road in Anambra State, you couldn't do those roads. You couldn't. Or even drag the federal government to do them, if they are federal government roads. Even your own, you couldn't do them. And and uh, uh, these people, eh? Uh, no, these people doesn't have the interest of the people at heart. It's a very big shame, sir. It's very very shameful that these people are fully fools. I'll see you guys on the next one. Let me know your own opinion with uh, what we have discussed so far. So use this opportunity to tell uh, this our brother <laughs> DK. Let him know that Nigeria is not for him. Because uh, if you feel that you're a celebrity in Nigeria that, uh, oh, we have arrived, oh, they're not going to embarrass us or harass us again. Lord, you know, they will harass you. If they, they waiting, the police will tell you, waiting for me that with that one. I bet bring money, Joe. Uh, you want chop a loan, you, they will extort you. Your hard earned money, they will extort you. So, Nigeria, <laughs> continue to, to, to pamper it. If all this Obi Kubana them had, you know, had a, 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 a what would i call it ranches or beware where they are training cows with heads of acres of land that we see ah this is cattle will be cubana cattle uh, industry if you enter there you just be walking and be driving and say ah will be cubana cows will be cubana a weeb a feeble there are all these uh, uh, people coming in in the name of want to bring cow they bring dagger they'll bring knife they'll bring weapons you won't be having them now. Where will you see them? I think I have one video where um, where the, the man who, Amotekun officer, who caught them in uh, Abuja, no, at um, Oshun State, was uh, lamenting. You know, all those kind of nonsense won't be happening if we have Igbo people uh, who has the interest of our own people at heart, who are doing investment that will affect us positively. It's not just about having millions. So I've given that guy two million. Does he? How does that help the community? 
do things, do your personal business that will affect the lives of your entire community. Will be in fact, entire Igbo land will become another thing entirely. But they no go do them. You, I, I gave him two million, and you think you have solved your problem? They will drag all of your DCFCC. They go, they look on the people now. See how they want to bring on down. I don't want to use common sense. I beg.